Mr. Dick Lane is going to bring you the accounts of the uh, occasion down there in the center of the ring. This is the semi windup. The auditorium tonight is packed to its very well lined capacity with um, enthusiastic wrestling fans to witness a, a real Jim Dandy. Between uh, Little Beaver, sensational dwarf wrestler, and another equally sensational little man, Irish Jackie. Here's Little Beaver with his unusual getup down the hair. Little Beaver himself. Here's a popular young man. His beaded and fringed leather jacket. There he is, Little Beaver. He bolts the top rope. He draws the toss of the disc from Jules Strongbow for selection of corner, draws the black corner on the far right side. And here comes Irish Jackie on the far side, coming up into the corner beyond Little Beaver. The comparison of size between these great men, Jules Strongbow and Little Beaver, is something to behold. Irish Jackie. In a green cape style robe. Get the size of these two men. Both of them wrestlers. Jules Strongbow, a retired wrestler, but a great crowd-pleasing heavyweight in his day. And his day is still here. He's still a young man. Here to identify them is Jules Strongbow. This is your semi-final event of the evening. Best two balls out of three with a 45-minute time limit. In the white corner, Weighing 89 pounds from Dublin, Ireland, Irish Jackie. His opponent this evening in the black corner from Canada, weighing 92 pounds, Little Beaver. Your referee, Ted Grice. Ted Grice, a referee appointed by the Athletic Commission of the State of California, calls his young man out to the center of the ring. Irish Jackie at 89 pounds on the left. A little Beaver at 92 on the right. They're instructed to abide by the rules and regulations set down by the Athletic Commission regarding time outside the ring. Ten seconds outside the uh, ring on the apron. Beaver and the gentleman fall off the apron onto the, onto the uh, floor of the arena. The match is automatically stopped. Knee lifts. Instructions regarding knee lifts are that the point of the knee is to be avoided if possible. Of course, uh, a great many times men are stung accidentally. The point of the knee cap brought smartly up to the face. No punching straight in. There's no handshake from the Irish boy as he moves to the corner and removes his green uh, robe. It's polka dotted with gold. The beaver removes his. Uh, Jerkin, a sleeveless uh, leather coat with fringes and beads. And the Indian version of trunks. Up comes the headband, beads and leather. The moccasins at the bell. There he steps out to meet Irish Jackie. The two out of three falls, a 45 minute time limit match. Little Beaver offers a handshake again. Irish Jackie says no handshake. Apparently these men have met somewhere before and there's some uh, animosity carried into this match. Little Beaver wrestling back. <laughs> oh, nice. The speed of Irish Jackie carried him outside onto the apron. There's contact from the referee's hold. Irish Jackie face locking. Little Beaver tackles him into the ropes and takes the advantage. The chin locks him off balance there, and Ted Grice says, step back. Whoa! <laughs> That's one way to get a clean break. Little Beaver keeps pulling the long hair down in Irish Jackie's face. He's great annoyance. Makes him look bad.
Side wrist lock moving into a top wrist lock by Alex Jackie. Oh, a beautiful sit back with the monkey flip by Little Beaver. A beautiful move. Quick as lightning. I'm strangling the right arm by Iris Jackie. Should ask the man now. Preparation refused by a little beaver. Top press block by a beaver. He locks it solidly. And Irish Jackie starts for the rope. He hooks the bottom rope is denied the use of it because of deliberate attempt to break the hole by contact with the rope. He sends the right hand straight in and whoo, this is his last warning. Free incident, he's got to see these things or he can't call them. And again, a top wrist block by a little beaver. And again, a driving punch that was returned with a forearm smash under the heart. The beaver, he said he did it with, it. with his hand. <laughs> Even Steven says, Ted Rice, he said, even Steven. He said, I didn't see either one of them. Too much deception in there for Ted Rice. He says, step back. There's a four-arm smash on the break. Bolo, four-arm smash to drop the beaver. Another one, under the heart this time. Jackie gets an okay from Ted Dreis for the forearm. Look at that slam. Slams him from the chin lock to headlock. The left shot in there, clubbed into the middle. The forearm clubbed across the chest.
front headlock by Beaver. Knuckles at the nose now. Irish Jackie was yelling choke. Muscularly. Now as Jackie picks him up with the trunks and carries him to the road. Wants him to count the shoulders. Little Beaver is still begging for one punch. Of course, Ted Dry's refusing. Up there, the hair mare by Irish Jackie. Again, he hooks that mohawk headpiece. Snap mare again. A knee drop across the neck. Irish Jackie deliberately now chin locks and bolos a forearm smash under the heart. Another hair mare. Another knee drop across the neck. Clutch for a body slam by the Irish Jackie. Pulls it up in a jackknife. That'll be all. The winner of the first fall, Irish Jackie over Little Beaver. Let's get the time now as Jules Strongbow moves in to check with timekeeper Jack Shaw. Let's get the official time, Ira Jackie, the win of the first fall. And the time of 10 minutes and 3 seconds for the body press, Ira Jackie, the winner of the first fall. Beaver's on his way to his feet. No lasting damage, I'm sure, to the young man. You're welcome his rest period. But the first fall went to Irish Jackie. Here's Dick Lane ready to bring you the second fall in the semi windup between Little Beaver and Irish Jackie. There's the bell, and Little Beaver's out with a drop kick. Whoa, Nelly, hang on to your hats, a monkey flip, and Little Beaver's on his way. Another drop kick, and he caught him square in the mouth that time. Off the ropes, he goes for another one, and he sent him in there. 
There he goes for the fourth one. In he goes. A giant swing now by Little Beaver. Round and round and round he goes. Where he goes, nobody knows. How he goes for it, but he dives in, makes it. What does he make? Pull up now. Three, and that'll be all. Whoa, Nelly, you saw this thing match. Whoa, whoa, Nelly. The winner, Little Beaver. That one should bring some kind of a record here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's one of the fastest ones. Let's get the time officially now. One seconds with a giant Indian swing and a body press little beaver, the winner of the second of all. Fifty-one seconds. Fifty-one seconds. It took little beaver to do that. The series of amazing drop kicks. And the body press pulled up into a half jackknife. Little Beaver all the way. 51 seconds. Second warning whistle, and there's the bell now. Little Beaver out for the finisher. I was Jackie a little old to come out of his corner. Little Beaver wants him out of the center of the ring. He wants to be close enough to the ropes to step outside. Need be. Oh, 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 oh. Holding hair. Little Beaver has drawn his warning. Little Jackie, Irish Jackie, making a big thing out of it now. He's going to call coppers, he's going to yell copper, he's going to sue City Hall, he's going to... Little Beaver took his warning. The nose now. Got him with the nose. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Nelly. Plain old-fashioned tweaking of the nose. It's called a twitch. That's a little kick. That man like a, like a lightning bug. Of the referee is all refused again by Irish Jackie. Oh. Little Beaver tried to reverse side wrist lock, but he was hooked with a compound forward quarter Nelson and clubbed to the back by Irish Jackie, who now takes a forward quarter Nelson. Watching the left arm for strangulation, okay by Ted Dryce. Jackie. Irish 
Jackie had too much strangulation with the left forearm across the neck of Little Beaver. The judo fork cuts to the neck and a third one by Irish Jackie. And a fourth one. And number five, and six, seven. The Beaver goes into the corner. Two is the count, three. Doggy Little Beaver, up into the right hand. There goes number eight. And applesauce. Trip to the neck with the second rope by Iris Jackie. He's a rough boy, this kid. And that goes again. Used to be called applesauce. Touch for a body slam now. Iris Jackie confident now that he's got his man. Whoa, he stopped. Each man touch locks. Each man going for a lift. Who's going to make it? There's only three pounds difference in their weights. Iris Jackie, 89, throws a right hand in the midsection. As he did it to the forearm. Side headlock, spasm twice, three times, four, and five. Twenty minutes have elapsed in this 45 minute time limit match. Ball accomplished by each man. Kip to the mat. Pulling forward on his headlock. Good move with it. <laughs> a little punch with the heel of his hand. Did it with the heel of his hand. It was okay. Dives in again and again, club. This time was not with the heel of his hand. Into the forward. Fast, you couldn't see which it was that time. Little Beaver's hot. Look out Look out now. Ooh, Look at those leaps. There's the Indian war hoop. And Little Beaver sets up a razzle dazzle here. Everybody's going everywhere. Where are they going? In by the hair. That monkey flip. That's a quick drop kick now. Oh, it's a judo cut to the neck. And another one. And still another one. And another. And another monkey flip by Little Beaver. Oh, Nelly, look at the speed. A drop kick. In he goes for a double jack knife. One, two, three. And it'll be all for Irish Jackie. Winner of the fall in the match, Little Beaver. The winner, Little Beaver, over Irish Jackie with a series of drop kicks and a body press pulled up into a double jack knife.